aren't you concerned about the language that Glenn Beck is using, which is, after all, inciting the American people? There's a lot of suffering out there, as you know, and when he talks about people being slaughtered, about who is going to be the next in the killing spree... Well, he was talking spree, about Hitler and Stalin slaughtering people, so I think he was probably accurate. Spread the wealth. Hello, Mao. That's what this is all about. And anyone not on board, look out, because you too could be the next victim of the killing spree. Is it far-fetched to think that, a, that Tsar Feinberg could go into Walmart and argue that it's just too important to the economy if Walmart fails? I mean, it's the biggest store in the world. We feel you're being reckless in your pay structure, Walmart. We've got to bring the unions in and control your pay. What about Rupert Murdoch? If News Corp failed, would it be harmful to the economic health of America? Of course, we don't want to look into GE that owns NBC. Of course, NBC plays along and is helpful to the administration. So what? They got bailout money? Why should we look over there? Obama has repeated over and over again just how dangerous, old, and unworkable our current economy is. It ain't nothing new. Also, no, no, I'm he a was little, talking about I, this administration. I don't, I don't misinterpret any of his words. And when you see the effects of what they're doing, the economy, remember these words. We will survive. We, no, we'll do better than survive. We will thrive as long as these people are not in control. They are taking you to a place to be slaughtered.